Hello everyone. In this video session, I'm going to explain how to retrieve the HTML code of a web element using Selenium. So before writing the Selenium code for retrieving the HTML code of the given web element, let me first show you the actual HTML code of the element. For that, I'll open the application. I'll open any sample application. Generally, I use this sample application, omaya.blogspot.com. So let's browse this. Once we go to the application, as you can see on this application page, there are several UI elements, right? So this search button is there, click to get alert is there, this text box field is there. Every element has some HTML code. So how to find the HTML code of a particular web element? So here, if I take uh, this example, okay, this button as an example, if I want to find the HTML code of this uh, button manually, so I have to right click on this button. This is a Chrome browser guys. And uh, this is a sample application. On the sample application, this button is there. Click to get alert. So I want to find the HTML code of this button. For that, right click here on the button and say inspect. There's an option like inspect here. Select that inspect option. You see, when I inspected this button, the HTML code of this particular button will be displayed here. You see, this is a, this highlighted line that you can see input ID alert one, type button on click display alert value, click to get alert is the HTML code of this button. Now, I want to retrieve this HTML code by using Selenium guys. Here I did manually, right? I inspected manually and I found the HTML code of this button, but I want to do the same thing. I want to retrieve this HTML code of this button using Selenium. How can we do that? Let me practically demonstrate. So here guys, here we have a main method. Inside the main method, uh, some sample three lines are already written for opening the Chrome browser and maximizing the browser. Once the Chrome browser is opened and maximized, we can open the application URL. Driver dot get we have to write for opening the application URL. So we'll take the same example. We'll take the sample application and here we'll provide this uh, URL. Okay, I copy pasted the URL of the application. So after opening this application, after opening this application like this, we want to find the HTML code. We want to retrieve the HTML code of this button. Click to get alert button. For that, uh, we need to create a locator. Okay, we need to locate this uh, web element that is button. So right click inspect this and you will get this. Uh, okay, this button has some ID guys, alert one ID. Copy this ID. And here, write driver dot find element by dot ID. And uh, paste the ID that you just now copied from here. Okay, from the HTML code of this particular button, we copied the ID and we pasted it here so that we can create a web element out of it. So this find element will return the web element. I will name this web element as some alert button, right? As you can see, this uh, alert button, some alert button. Over the mouse, create local variable, web element got created. Now, using this web element, I'll copy this web element here, alert button, and I will call a method that is get attribute method, okay? Get attribute command of Selenium web driver. Using this command, and uh, to this get attribute, we have to pass some attribute, that is, you have to pass something like outer HTML. Like this, you have to pass, guys. When you specify this outer HTML attribute in this get attribute, this get attribute command will retrieve the HTML code of this web element, that is alert buttons. This HTML code of this particular button will be retrieved by this get attribute command by using this given attribute outer HTML. If you specify outer HTML, then this get attribute command will retrieve the HTML code of this alert button. You see, when you hover the mouse on get attribute, it's returning string guys, string. So I'll say HTML code of given web element is equal to, okay? HTML code of given web element is equal to like that. Hover the mouse, create local variable, done, string type. Now let's print out this HTML code of the given web element so that we can see like uh, whether this uh, get attribute using this attribute has really retrieved the HTML code of this button and stored into this variable. Let's see that for that, I will simply copy paste this uh, variable, string variable here, and uh, this println statement will print the HTML code. So after doing so, I'll simply close the browser guys, okay? After, uh, after this uh, retrieval happened and printed in the output, we'll simply close the browser. So for that, I'm using driver.close. Now save this code and run this code guys. In the output, we should get this HTML code, input ID alert one, type button, on click display alert. Everything we should get till here. Value click to get alert, okay? Everything we should get. Let's run this code or run this. Yeah, we have run this. 
the application uh, the browser will launch the application will be opened there and uh, as you can see it will close okay it has closed and if you see the output clearly if you see this uh, output in the output console of eclipse id clearly this is the html code that got retrieved and printed here guys okay the html code of this button that is click to get alert button got retrieved and printed here input id alert one you see the same html code got retrieved and printed fine so simply this is the line guys okay what is the exact line for retrieving the html code of the given web element this is a web element and uh, for retrieving we have used get attribute and we provided the attribute like outer html for retrieving the html code of the given element simple guys this is the focus point for understanding the current topic that is retrieving the HTML code of a web element using Selenium. So hope guys you understood how to do this. So that's it guys. Thank you. Bye.